Hello everybody, my name is Mayo and welcome back to my channel and today I'm very very excited because in my beauty career I have only received three PR package from the brand's headquarters not from Hong Kong, from their headquarters The first one is Drunk Elephant and the second one is Nude Sticks and today I'll be reviewing a very special brand which is House of Laboratory Woo! I'm very excited because this is the first beauty brand that Lady Gaga has launched it as their first drop and apparently my name was handpicked by Lady Gaga so I'm very very honored that I get to play around with her beauty products and if this is your first time on my channel please remember to subscribe to my channel because I upload videos very regularly every Tuesday and Thursday I have new videos up at 9 o'clock and most of my videos are beauty product related so if you're a beauty guru you should definitely stay tuned to my channel if you want to see how this look was created please Keep on watching. Yeah. So basically, I have received it four different kinds of products from House of Laboratories. Uh, I've got the liquid shadow, the lip pencil, the lips gloss, and also this is really cool. A sticker. It's like a eyeliner kind of a wing sticker that I'll be trying on today too and I'll be doing a very signature House of Laboratory looks I'll try my best trying on and I'll be using the Glam Attack liquid eyeshadow I've tried these textures and they are very very similar to the Stila um, liquid shadow but then this these are more easy to blend because um, Stila ones is very um, glittery and it's very hard to blend when you apply to your eye because it dries really quickly as well but these ones are way more easier to blend I'll show you okay so today I will be trying a makeup that I've never done before it might turns out crazy but um why not because it's Lady Gaga I've been a fan since poker face so yeah let's get it started first I'm gonna get a very pointed brush which looks like this and then get some products start doing Today is all about being out of the box, out of the comfort zone. It's really hard to draw it even, to make both sides even. Okay, these are very, very easy to blend, as you can see. And it's not as glittery as I expected. As you can see, it's more of the, like a tip of the glitter. So yeah, I've drawn a very s sleek line on the upper eye. Next, I'm going to be try to stick this. Okay, as you can see, there's two length of the cat eye. There's a thicker one and a thinner one. And today, I think I'll be trying on the thinner one. I'm just gonna use my... Actually, I'm, I'm, I'll be using this... Yeah. Okay. Ugh! looks really sticky but let's try it on oh my god it looks so weird though am i doing this right this looks a bit weird but let's try like this is it supposed to be like this just stick it on okay right that's easy i need a liquid liner i need something really dark and then i'll be using the same products the black one to join the sticker that i just Put on. Ooh, it's looking good. It's very natural. And the color, it's not as dark as I expected. So I'll apply a second layer on top of the liner. Okay, looks good. And then I will be drawing something in the middle to link up both sides. Okay, I just wanted to say it's very, very easy to blend. Let's see what color I have. Um, I have gotten three different colors. Okay, I'm gonna try this color. It's called Rose Bitch. I'm gonna put on my hand to see. Okay, it's a little purplish nude color. 
I'm gonna put that in the middle. I'm gonna pick up another brush. Actually, I'm just gonna apply the whole thing on, just like. Oh my god, it feels really good. And I wanted to say the glitter, it's not as big, as chunky as the Stilla, which I think is really good. It's not like BAM, like really glittery on your face. It's more like, like a very sheen type of glitter. Okay, I'm going to go back to the black one and then blend in both color that I've added together. And then I'm going to get a clean brush to smudge it in. These liquid shadows are 170 Hong Kong dollars, which is very, very reasonable. And you get a huge bottle of products. And then I'm going to use this more glittery color and place it in the middle and make it more brings the shine of the whole total eye look. By the way, these are, you can get these products um, exclusively on um, Amazon and also on their House of Laboratory website, which I was a little shock because i thought that um i don't know lady gaga would launch it in sephora or something i'm sure lady gaga wants it to be more accessible so that's why she has chosen to launch it in amazon okay and then i have prepared um these little pearl stickers that i think would really goes with the lady gaga look you know i mean it's pearl like who would suddenly put a pearl on their eye other than the one and only Lady Gaga. So um, these, I got these from Taobao. They're really cheap, like $20, Hong Kong dollars. Let's put it on, I don't know where, um, probably on my under eye. Okay, and I'm gonna add a little tiny small bit one on the end of the eye, which is here. One thing that I wanted to say, it's um, the liquid shadow does actually comes off very easily. It doesn't like cramp on your skin. When you smudge it, after it dries, it does get smudged, which depends on what type of products you like. Oh my God. Okay, so I'm gonna quickly do the other eye and I'll come back very soon. Oh my God, it's good. I can do it. Yes, 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 yes. It's balanced. It's really hard. I don't usually, can do a very even eye so yeah it's a good start okay let's do it let's keep going i'm having a good day good makeup day even though it's almost getting late now it's um 4 30 in hong kong oh almost five o'clock so the sticker has to be even as well because the dimension will change the whole shape of your eye so please if you use these stickers make sure they are even please 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 a very even. Yes. High five. Okay, I'm gonna finish off the liner. You know, I've actually received these products for like two weeks, three weeks, and I've been wanting to a review. But then I, I've been doing a lot of research on thinking what makeup look I should do. So this look is inspired by um, Lady Gaga herself and also Nikki Tutorial, which is one of my favorite beauty YouTuber. I just thought that, you know, doing a very classic House of Laboratory looks, it's fun. I can already imagine taking a lot of pictures after doing this look. Okay. Yay! So after I do the outline, I'll be going in with the blending so that the shadows is blended with the look. And then I'll add more products to increase the density, the darkness, the look. Damn, can you see the shine? It's great. Apply the purple-ish color on top, like this. So the brand has been announced in July and first launched it in um, September. Now the product range has only got um, lip gloss, um, eyeliner, the liquor shadows, the lip liner, not, not that wide range of products. When the brand first came out, I was a little bit disappointed that the product range is quite um, not what I expected. 
But I mean, after seeing a lot of positive review of these products, I now truly understand why Lady Gaga have chosen only released it these products for the first launch. These products are very, very unique. It has a great formula, and the packaging is really cool. I mean, everything is very, very Lady Gaga. I mean, it will be very common or very commercial for Lady Gaga first launch a beauty brand with you know all. Um, lipsticks and stuff it's, it's not what Lady Gaga would do so I mean what she's doing right now I think it's perfect okay and then I'm going to be apply some highlight and blush just to match with the looks these are from um, Hourglass Spanish highlight stick. I think it really matches with the House of Laboratory products because it has a little pink sheen on it, which suits the pink sheen on the, my liquid eyeshadow as well. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I love that shine. Okay, and then I'm going to put a little blush. My blush I'll be applying right here, just a little bit to give a little color of the look also I'll be adding a bronzer across my bridge of the nose because I think this look really matches with like a really bronzed type of texture and when the first campaign photos of House of Laboratories launched um, a lot of people were saying that I don't know if you have noticed it but then the photos are, were actually really raw like really untouched unlike other beauty um, campaigns that has a lot of photoshops but Lady Gaga's ones kept it really real with just pure the makeup straight out from the photos straight from the camera doesn't have any like a textures that refine their pores or you know make the line more fine you know more defined and stuff which I really respect that because I have always been telling my followers to believe in yourself and to believe in true beauty I mean cosmetics it's very fun to um, play with and it gives you confidence which it's also very very important but also don't overdo it which I think Lady Gaga is trying to deliver that message to her audience Okay, so the next, we are going to try the lips. I have two lip liner right here. One is called Right, and one is called Slayer. I am going to try Right, which is a dark nude color. Let me think what kind of lips I would like to do. Okay. Okay, so first I'm going to tell you the textures is not really creamy. It's very easy to draw on the lips, but it's not creamy. Unlike Kylie Jenner's, you know, lip pencil. It's actually quite drying, but drying not in a bad way. It's like more easy to draw. You know, sometimes when it's really creamy, when you draw on your, your lips, it's just like really smooth and like sometimes you just slipped away. But this one, because it's quite dry, it's the control, it's better. But it doesn't look creamy, so that's one point. And you can see this color applies on my lips. Um, which has a little like reddish um, tone on it which was a little unexpected because I thought it would be quite nude so House of Laboratories is actually the first exclusive cosmetics brands that um, is on their platform so it's their first time I mean it's first Lady Gaga's products and first time on Amazon so this collapse yep you know it's very special I'm not sure if the brand will eventually be on other platforms I would suggest Lady Gaga to do so because I mean it's great product more people should be able to experience it but um you know I mean it's Lady Gaga you never know what her next step is okay then I'm going to try on this lip gloss um, this color is called Venus you know that song oh shoot this one it's quite unique I've never seen anything like this before how would you say it it's like a it's like a like a very weird shape which I don't know how it applies. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Okay, so you see this one has a, it's like a really weird shape that you don't normally see it on a lip gloss, which I think this tip, it's more better for your lower lips and the smaller side of the tip, it's better for your upper lips. So um, it's more precise to control the amount of products you apply, but I'll try on first. Okay, this will be a first impression. So you see the shorter tip. When you put it on your lips, it hugs your lips like this. 
so it's very secure and easy to draw like that and the other side of the tip it's easy to draw on a lower I mean I'm not 100% feeling the formula of the lip gloss I mean the pigmented on the lip gloss it's not super high but I would expect it to be like a very extreme type of lip gloss but when I put it on it actually looks quite natural which is very very unexpected as you can see I've applied like two layers and it looks quite natural and it doesn't feel tacky as well and the texture of the lip gloss is quite you know quite thin it's not tacky at all unexpected but the color this nude it's I'm not 100% feeling it cool so this is the finished look of my Lady Gaga first beauty brand House of Laboratories review I'm very honored that they have sent me these products because receiving products from overseas from their headquarters is a big achievement of my beauty career so I'm very very happy about this and even though I've received these products all of my opinions of this videos it's my true opinion it's not a sponsored video so I hope you guys actually do get I do hope that you guys enjoyed my look and um, remember to subscribe to my channels. I upload videos every Tuesday and Thursday at nine o'clock. And remember to give a thumbs up to this video. And I will be seeing you on my next video very soon. Goodbye. Oh, good job, team. Oh, yeah. Wow, very good. Today, come on, come on, go down, go down, deal. Ah, it's like that. Okay. Hello. Say bye. 两只两个样系嘛？诶，你自己话事，我而家我而家唔唔讲得嘢。呢就系 cameraman 俾说话我听啊，大佬。跟住啲男人系完全系讲咩啊？诶，装快快啲啊，快快快啲啊！哇，好立体啊！哇，好衬件衫啊！咩事啊？喂，真系 O K 喎。我要可唔可以咁去食饭咧？阵间会打我咧。